Hey everyone, here's a question from Integers and the question is find each of the following products. Now this question can come for one mark or two mark. Now this is very simple. They're not asking us to use any property and solve. They're just asking just to find the product means multiply the numbers and get the answer. Only thing is we have to be careful while multiplying with negative signs. So let's start the first one. So here is a solution and here is a first question. So we have minus 65 multiplied by minus 10 multiplied by 9 so first I'm going to multiply first two numbers you can multiply all the three together it's completely on you so 65 multiplied by 10 is 650 okay 65 into 10 is 650 now remember you're multiplying to negative numbers whenever you multiply negative numbers even number of time even number of time the answer will gonna always be a positive one like minus into minus is plus here if you're multiplying negative sign odd number of time your answer will always be negative whatever answer you're getting it will gonna have negative sign so here I'm multiplying two negative sign and two is an even number right so after multiplying I don't have to put negative uh, I don't have to put negative sign here it will be positive number 650 is positive number and then multiplied by 9 so this we're gonna give us 5850 so this was first question like that we're gonna solve the second one so in second question we have minus 20 multiplied by minus 2 multiplied by minus 3 multiplied by 5 now remember like I said before if you're multiplying a negative number odd number of times you can see in the second question we have a three negative signs three negative sign represent that your final answer we're going to have a negative sign in it okay so let's start solving so again you can multiply all the number together you can write down the answer you can multiply two two numbers so I'm going to multiply first two numbers these two numbers so 20 into 2 is 40 yeah 20 into 2 is 40 but like minus into minus is plus or I'm multiplying two negative number and 2 is even number so answer will be positive again multiplied by I'm going to multiply last two number so 3 5 are 15 only one negative sign is there one is odd so minus I'll get now 15 into 40 is 600 but again only one negative sign is there and one is odd so we'll get minus sign here so that's it I hope it's clear in case you have any questions or doubts you can drop a comment below thank you so much for watching